one of the questions that I often get in the comments and on private message is, Marco, where, where do you buy the tractors, the diggers, the dumpers and stuff that you get? So it could be from private listings, auctions, or the other way that are buying stuff now and selling is on Marketplace E, uh, on Iron Planner. So, a lot of you remember James from Ritchie Brothers, and you'll have seen us when we've talked before briefly about Marketplace uh, E. We sell everything, everything from the older stuff all the way through up to brand new kit in tractors, in construction kit, we, we sell it all. The Marketplace gives the sellers that option to sell with a reserve, an asking price. The machinery has to come up to our yard, we go through it and essentially get a full inspection report. We go through the quality of the, the machinery, we make sure everything's working, all the functions are there, everything is right. As a result of that, the buyers then have the confidence in the machinery. We're not just talking like you normally see in an ad, four photos and one careful owner, blah, blah, blah. It is rigorous, isn't it? it I mean, is, yeah. what's, 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 literally over a hundred photos I've seen on some machinery. Videos. Yeah, pickup hitch works and lights work and this works. We've tried, they try everything, yeah. you know. And if there's something not working, we'll highlight that as well. So again, the buyers know. Because I'm thinking, okay, I've got a factor in though, I've got to replace that or repair yeah. that. Yeah. But at least I know, and that's, you know, I mean, that's a good thing. Let's just take an example, I don't know, a, a digger. Yeah. Price seems good. Photos, the four photos you see look all right, but it's in Kilmarnock or something. That's a fair journey for me. Now I've spoken to the bloke maybe on the phone or whatever. Oh, he assures me that's brilliant. I'm, I'll hold my hands up. I have traveled a few hours before, got to the place and just literally within 10 minutes back in the truck and I'm going home because it is an absolute piece of junk. Yep. At least with the marketplace thing, the concept you guys are doing, there are so many photos. There's such an in-depth description. I can at least from that go, do you know what? This is worth going to have a look at. Yeah, yeah and it, the, the inspections are done by our team as an independent group of group of inspectors. Yeah. They go through the machines and they will find the faults if they're there. But again, it just gives that confidence and the buyer. The buyer knows that it's not the seller saying, oh, it's got 80% it's, it's, it's actually New got 50% yeah. yeah. So And we'll stand by that and say, yeah, this is how it is actually described. Yeah. Customers. A lot of our buyers will be overseas. They've not got that luxury. So to have that full inspection online for them to actually view and actually see, it gives them that bit more confidence. We've now just introduced our online inspection, essentially. Yeah. Virtual inspection where a customer, a potential buyer, can phone us up in the yard and one of our operations team will go out into the yard with a, with a video and go through all the machine live in front of, in front of the potential so buyer. So I, I could turn around as a, a potential buyer and say, like, listen, that massy here and I, can you just have a look at, you know, just as an example, the, the wear on the rear hitch and whatever. Can you just give them arms yeah. a lift? And they can do that. Yeah, whatever you want us to have a look at, we'll have a look at look at it for you online, on the camera. And I can see it there you can live. See it, audio, visual, the works. So if I was like a potential seller for yeah. something, like a bit of kit, I've got a tractor or whatever, because you can offer that, and you can offer, you know, not only the, all those pictures and the inspection, but a, a tailored, inspection yeah. for me i've all suddenly i've got not people just in the uk look at my bit of kit to potentially buy it all over you well, all over the world really so you've opened up yeah. that market from just being the uk for potential buyers of my bit of kit to being global and um, the channels that we advertise the kit through our own internal ones the richie Wells website iron planet marketplace mascus it all gets advertised it's on funny, that's richie brothers as well yeah that's another richie, Bro yeah. richie brothers platform yeah um but also third party companies websites we advertise through there as well yeah so we're we're investing in that marketing to get that global reach to find that right buyer for that specific piece of kit yeah, yeah. that's why they're coming to us spending that money on on the advertising side of things and, and getting them sold don't stop now i'm having a biscuit <laughs> a nice biscuit <laughs> biscuits. All right, so let's take a snapshot of what you currently got here, because yeah. I had a good look around, and I want to show you know my viewers the sort of stuff you've got in at the moment. You've got some good stuff in. We've got diggers, telehandler, we've got access stuff and whatever, but you have got a fantastic array of agricultural kit at the moment. Both, uh, as I've said, harvesting equipment. Uh, Grimmies, so you've got the, um, although they're set up at the moment for onions, 
but basically bunker harvesters, you know, potatoes and, and onions and yeah, whatever. Yeah, pair of SVs up there, yeah. Yeah, so, that, which is nice because, you know, there's a big leap from a trailed harvester to a self-propelled. They're sort of like a halfway between thing. Then you've got obviously spud planters, you know, again, real tidy yeah. examples of those. Yep. Yeah. Um, then you've got two lovely beet harvesters, right, grooming beet harvesters. Yeah. Now, um, nice age, nice condition on them. Yeah, 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 and they are, they are, you know, all together and nice. But I did like the, the one, which I've seen photographs, I've never seen one actually in the flesh, one on tracks. So you've got a real nice array of, of stuff there from Grimmy. Yep. Then you've got, in, like, in here. Well, man, I mean, what? This is just, this is like, you know, Handy's toy shop for me. Look how they're presented. They look lovely, don't they? I know. Cleaned off. Yeah, but you don't get this in A. No. You don't get this. No. This is like one of those bloody car showrooms. All you've got to do is get it up to our yard. We'll take care of everything from the inspection side, get it all transacted, getting it cleaned off if required for export. We can cover all that. But also from a buyer's perspective, hosting customers, hosting potential buyers, you've not got to have somebody so coming yeah, around saying, oh, yeah, and that's the, we can host everyone For here. me, that was one of the biggest selling points for me to mm. start putting stuff on it. The reason is because, you know, we know doing all this and whatever, I'm busy. Yeah. And as much as I'd love to go and have, you know, have a sausage roll on the grin with a potential buyer, I don't have the time. No. You take all that stress away, don't you? Yeah. You sort all that. That's we your cover, problem. We, cover, we get no WhatsApp messages coming through and you know, questions coming in. It's all handled by us and you get an email at the end of it. Do you want to accept it or decline that, yeah. that offer? And that's that's it. it's easy. You can yeah. carry on about your day, your work and whatever. Yeah. That's your problem, yeah. you know. Yeah. Uh, no, that's, that's one of the big selling points for me. So, should we have a look around? <laughs> yeah, too right. So there we go. No. That's uh, that's where we buy and sell kit. You know, places like uh, Marketplace E, uh, and obviously the auctions. But uh, if you want to keep up with the other stuff that we're doing uh, on a Wednesday now, 7 p.m., uh, I put out another little video each week now called Mucking About, which is my sort of day-to-day -day stuff. Trying to kiss. Hi. <laughs> love you. You do look lovely. Yeah. You just gone for. Right, right. See, try to wind me up. <laughs> so then Sundays, you got the you got the main event. Um, you also, obviously, uh, as well, you got Instagram. So uh, there's there's plenty to uh, plenty to look at. But there we go. So yeah, I know, I know it's time. It's that time again. I know that. Better go. So until the next one. Do well. <laughs>